yeah, the more diverse we get, right, the less we have in common with each other, and uh, the more difficult it is to form bonds, create social cohesion, social trust, and can be useful generalization for that America. Now, founding people of a country will have a profound effect on its institutions, on its rhetoric, and even when their numbers diminish, such as the case with Anglos, right? Anglos still have a disproportionate influence on how America works because our judicial system and our political system is dominantly Anglo. Damn, I missed uh, Glib Medley's commentaries that have been deleted. This is the UCLA uh, Law School. So UCLA is among the top 10 of America's universities when you're, you're grading on the, on the basis of uh, faculty research. Right? So if you're grading strictly on the quality of undergraduate education, right, probably not top 10. But if you're grading on the quality of graduate schools, UCLA is definitely in the top 10. It's law school in the top 20. And uh, long somewhat been in the shadow of Berkeley, but increasingly coming out of that shadow. Very different vibe at UCLA. Much calmer, more genteel vibe, or LA vibe at UCLA compared to Berkeley. Universities like Cornell and Columbia, which is so proud of their activism history, All right? So you go to a job, go to a university, go to a church, right? and they extol all sorts of values, which may have absolutely nothing to do with their real values. An individual's public pronouncements about this or that are not particularly likely to reflect what he really values. And so many students have gotten education, the nature of reality, that uh, university's stated value of uh, glorifying dissent and activism doesn't necessarily correlate with their real values. And if you want to succeed in the workplace or in an academy or with a particular professor or with just an individual or a community, a synagogue, a church, right, you have to be able to distinguish between that individual and that institution's real values and their stated values, right? No necessary connection between the institution's stated values and what they really value. And when it comes to protests and activism, it's uh, a lot easier to value that when it's in the past, when it's causing chaos and disruption.